So we can use the cleaning schedule in LNR to see what cleans and um, what, what things there are for the cleaning team to do on a day-to-day -day basis. And we can also plan for a longer period. So you can look at the filters if you want to look for a wider date range. And it will give us a, a day by day like that. So here we can see through to Saturday the 26th. If we look at today, we can see all of the accommodations and we can see the status of the uh, room, whether it's clean or dirty. And we can also see um, any specific notes, like it says here that this, um, this guest uh, requires um, to have um, um, alcohol hand um, gel uh, placed into their accommodation. I can flick just to see any uh, accommodations which are um, dirty. Only can see there's only one clean that's required to be done today. Um, and we can also see when the next arrival is. So it's the 31st of March. So whether that's done today or not um, uh, is dependent on the, uh, the process with the cleaning team. And if I feel uh, and just look at um, a different uh, day, you'll also be able to see that um, we've got an additional clean which is scheduled in on that day. So generally speaking, you can see all the accommodation information, the arrival and departure of that guest, what the status is, whether they're staying over on that particular day as in they're not departing yet, whether it's vacant, whether someone's due out, um, any uh, housekeeping notes, or any housekeeping add-ons, when the next arrival is, and when the next departure is. You can print this report, And you can also export this report, which will go to CSV in Excel. And you can open it up from there or send it to someone, or they can download it for themselves. You can make sure that your housekeeping team have access to this report and this report only, if they're an external company, so they can get access to this information. You don't have to send it to them.